How are you doing today? My name is Bill. And what I'd like to show you today is how a person with a laryngectomy can utilize uh, Spurria and the inhaler, which is for people with COPD. This is a container that you, if you're familiar with it at all, actually opens up. You put the caplet in there and it goes into your mouth. And it's a laryngectomy. It won't do you any good in your mouth. Your air comes through your neck into your lungs. So, what you're going to do is you're going to open this up. Just like you would if you were a person who breathed through your mouth. Now what you're going to do is you're going to take the little packet where the caplet is in. It's a powderized form. You're going to open it up very carefully and insert it into the device that goes into your normally your mouth, but this time it'll go into your neck. Go ahead and close it, push the button in, which opens the caplet up and punctures it, only do it once. Now what I like to do is I like to tap it a couple times, just to help get the powder out. Now for the next part, I won't be able to talk that much, but here's what you're going to do. You're going to take your filter out. If you do not wear a filter or a neck piece, this will still work the same. It is not required to have a HME adapter blade, Larry tube, or Larry button. It'll fit in any of those, and it'll fit in an open stone as well. Now before I do it, if you do this probably first thing in the morning, you're, you're probably prone to coughing. Take some very deep breaths. Get the coughing out of the way first, because you don't want to inhale this, and then cough and lose it. It should be good now. Sorry, as well, it's still off, but the powder, it goes in very rapidly, and it sticks to the mucus, so you're not coughing it out. Do it usually you do it twice, and then you're okay. At that point, open it up, throw away the caplet, and start your day. But a person with a laryngectomy can take Spareva and the Ailer powderized for and it's the only one that's available in right into your stoma. It's actually more efficient than going in through your mouth because it's direct to your lungs and it will work for you. I hope this has been a benefit to you and please look forward to some of the other videos for laryngectomies and how you can make different things work for you that you weren't aware of. Thanks very much. Bye-bye.